Anzac Day is one of the most important days in the Australian and New Zealand calendars, where we remember the sacrifice of those who served and died for our countries in wars, conflicts and peacekeeping operations. It means my uncles, my great uncles, who served here in Europe in the First and the Second World War. It means the New Zealand peacekeepers who are serving today um, in South Sudan, in the Middle East, and who've served quite recently in the Pacific, much closer to home. Anzac Day, to me, is about sacrifice. It's about bravery, it's about loyalty, it's about mateship. It's a time to recall those who have served their country and those who are currently serving, particularly overseas, and most importantly, those who have fallen, lest we forget. Reflecting on what Anzac Day means to me has brought back cherished memories marching alongside my grandfather at Anzac Day parades in Australia. He served as a Red Beret paratrooper. And as an Aboriginal woman and proud descendant of the Kumbamere people, I would also like to take a moment to pay tribute to the brave Indigenous men and women who served so that our people could have a brighter future. It means those who are fighting a different kind of battle on the front lines, all the hospital uh, and primary care workers who are doing such extraordinary work in terms of COVID-19. We are hugely grateful and we thank all of you for your service. Tia Kaha. As a dad, I've got great sympathy for anyone who lost their son or daughter in war. And to us every day is in a way Anzac Day because in the morning we think of them and at the end of the day we think of them. Lest we forget. 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 The standing apart, but together as one. Lest we forget. We will remember them. We will remember them. Lest we forget. Lest we forget.